They only play like six strong gear, kind of making me crazy. Before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Meriwether, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score. And then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, happy. So how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you must know Leon, the old manager. Leon? I didn't know. Yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago, in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. Uh, yeah. Sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there are other guys, though, too. So, uh, anyway, we uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. But always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one! What is the big one? <laughs> the Union Depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if we live through the attempt. But, but it'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Taking the temperature? Yeah, you know, getting a feel for it. Security, exit routes, general vibe. That doesn't look like much. Man, security looks light. We send in a couple of sprung niggas, clap, clap. What are you talking about, Frank? Oh, I see it. Man, getting in the door is easy. It's a standard bank. It's getting underground is hard. Ain't that where the metal's kept? Right. Now we gotta stop outside the Arcadia Center down on Alta Street. We can get a view of the back from there. Hey man, you might not notice it, but I picked up a few things rolling with you. I mean, there's times I think I gotta be the senior partner in the group, from the way you and Trevor behave. Ah, uh, sorry, there's history there. Yeah, it still ain't fully been explained to me though. Look, dawg, light again, man. Yeah, fucking eerie, ain't it? Man, you think they put more than one motherfucker on our national fucking reserves? Yeah, huh? Maybe we really are broke. Trevor, how are you doing? Uh, well... Uh, I like clockwork, Mikey. I like clockwork. You are a really fast driver. You mentioned a uh, job before, something we can help you with. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. What is it? Ain't it obvious? Bustin' Brad out of the clink. 
How do you talk to Michael now? Oh, fuck! Shit! I was gonna pay you, man, when there ain't an obvious profit in something. You're a hard guy to motivate. Thirteen thirty. We're an hour down. Two to go. I really pound. Do they call it a wasting disease because you waste people's time? Move it. Don't worry, it's a straight road. 
them in there. I'm picking up the cars. Right on time. Hey, it, uh, it looks like we're going to need some IDs to get in the building this way. I'm assuming that's doable, Les. IDs I can handle. Onion 86 in sight. Stand by. Hey, I was expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Onion 86 in the building. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro Tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that! Looking for a big asshole! options. There's you, a guy I know I can depend on, and then there's Trevor. Ah, yeah, Trevor will get it done. And will he? I hope so, man. I hope he holds it together. Hey, you ain't done too good of a job at that yourself, you feel me? Yeah, well, I ain't pissed off hillbillies, bikers, a Mexican gang, some Chinese gangsters, and a private army, okay? So there's that. Yeah, but you just pissed off the FIB and the IAA. And your family, man. You know what, I met Amanda and I know who scares me the most. <laughs> point taken. So you gonna tell me about this Brad dude and the deal with the FIB? What happened in North Yankton back in the day anyway? This ain't the time. Man, we about to go in together on the biggest job ever being pulled. There ain't ever gonna be a better time to fill me in on this shit. It's complicated, all right? Fuck it, I'm gonna ask Trevor. Don't ask Trevor. Shit, man, you sound shady, dawg. Real shady. We'll talk, all right? Just later. Ain't you looking? You entitled piece of shit! Hey, when he's got something, Lester will be in touch. 